What is up guys, this is Victory1270 and today we are back at it again in Dirt Racing Mobile. Today we are going to be racing, looks like late models, starting from track 1 and maybe getting to track 6, that's where we got in the modified, so yeah, let's get into it. Okay, race number 1 here at track number 1. Ran into that guy a little bit, got us a little bit loose. Do almost a slide drop there on those extremely ugly cars, and they try to spin me out because of me calling them ugly, which is fair enough. Hit the inside wall there. Bang doors with that guy going down the back stretch. Making our way up, we are currently in first, going to kind of block. I'm going to wreck myself, just trying to not get wrecked by these guys. These late models are a lot harder to drive than even the mods. Like I'd say these things are close to the difficulty level of the midgets. If you've played the midget game, you know that those don't. They turn, but they turn all at once. Like you can hold it down for quite a ways, and then all of a sudden it'll just catch and then just turn. It's like there's just no grip in parts of the track and like a whole bunch in other parts of the track. So I don't know, but we'll take the dub here. So yeah, next race. All right, race number two at track number two here. Track two is basically the same as track number one, except I almost, how did I not wreck there? We are chilling, okay. As I was saying, track number two is basically the same as track number one, except the straightaways are shorter. Bang doors with that guy all the way through the corner, and we'll just hit the leader, just like for a little, hey, I'm here, and I'm going to pass you now. Didn't get the lead coming off of that corner, but I think we'll get it this lap. As long as I don't spin myself out, and as long as the buttons work properly, should be a pretty easy win here. If you're wondering why I'm saying that's because two times in this recording session the buttons have just decided to not work and I just go straight into the wall. Which is frustrating, but we continue. So yeah, next race. Okay, race number three at track number three here. This track has relatively long straightaways and pretty tight corners and this guy's just going to spin me out. It's okay, my car is way faster than his, and we're just going to blow by him. Okay, that was a good corner. Holy cow, there's just a pack right here. Mm, almost ruined my race right there, but we saved it. Here we go. In the wall there, that guy kind of hooks me, but we're good. We are chilling. Now we just have to not screw ourselves. Really close to screwing ourselves in that corner. What I've been doing is letting off right as I get to the line and then gassing it like I did right there, except like better and it's been working okay and I kind of want to try putting the gas down putting the hammer down all the way through the corner but at the same time I don't want to ruin my race 
on an experiment with a car that I won't use for probably another couple of weeks at this said track. Because the next time I'll use it will be on professional mode. Because I don't really play most of the games that I record out of when I'm not recording. So that I don't. Because most of them have a story mode. Like this one kind of has a career mode, story mode, whatever. MTT does. Stock cars I can play just to like make money so that I can upgrade the cars. Um, dirt tracking. Play the career mode, which is actually a really good career mode. And I might eventually play that if people stop doing multiplayer. So yeah, next race. Okay, race number four here at track number four. This track has really wide corners. Can make it really difficult to pass people because you want to be on the inside, but then sometimes the car just decides to do that and just turns dead left despite you not touching the controls at all. We are covering though, back up to 8th, moving up into 7th here, going to try to get 6th coming out of this corner, maybe get 5th going down, nope, okay, not, uh, I don't know how I got through that corner, now we're up into 3rd, now I think this is 2nd, because I think it counted us behind the red car. Don't know why that guy decided to spin me out. Okay. Next time by, we got the white flag. White flag is out. And coming out of four, the checkered flag. Yeah, next race. Okay, race number five here at track number five. Naturally, track number five is just track number four, except a little bit shorter in the straightaways. All the way up in the fourth here as I almost spin myself out. Gonna maybe make a slide job for first. Count us at second, but now we're in first. Going down the back stretch. Almost gonna bounce off all those tires again. Send pretty good lap times here, as I say, as I just almost ruined my race. Luckily, we used the brake, but it doesn't even matter because they still did it. Catch up to me, and I think if I wouldn't have done that, maybe would have been able to lap some people. Almost ruined it again, and we'll just take it easy through this corner, except we're just going to put it on the wall and make that way closer than it needed to be. Well, next race. Okay, race number six at track number six here. This track has really tight corners. So you gotta let off a lot and then just turn left and hope that it sticks. Kinda like that. Oh, that was a beautiful slide job for first. Just slide it in the corner and hope it goes the way that I want it to, I guess. A 
Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. That was not good. It's okay, we'll still pull right back away from him. Give him a little bit of hope. Gave him second place with that insane slide job. And now we're going to make it look like he actually has a chance to win when he, in reality, probably does, actually. Because, like, if I just do that really bad in the next corner, which I didn't, he probably would have won. So, yeah, that's probably going to be the last race of this video because it was nine minutes long when I started recording this race. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see all of you in the next video.